people get confused when I start throwing that word horizontal vector out there. Well, let me explain a little bit what I'm trying to accomplish here. You can see that the way I'm set up here, the band is pulling me forward. The forces that are occurring are occurring on a, what we call a horizontal plane. As a result, that's going to challenge my muscles much differently than if I was doing this same split squat with dumbbells. All right, so the dumbbells are going to create more of a vertical vector. That's more consistent with gravity. The problem is this. All day long, we deal with gravity. Yeah, every step you take, every time you get up from a chair, every time you move, you are opposing gravity and working with having to handle those forces. You know, your joints over time are going to get beat up from that. We're all going to sustain problems with joints being wore out. That's what gravity does to us. So in your exercise program, if we can do exercises that are not going to challenge gravity so aggressively, but instead allow us to train our muscles in a different way that still makes them stronger, that's going to be a positive thing. And that's what I'm talking about when I'm talking about incorporating horizontal vectors. Now, this simple setup can be used, as I said, for split squats. It can be used for lunges. It can be used for just simple body weight squats. It can be used for running drills. We can step out of it. And we can use it for pulling or pushing. All right, we can go ahead and lay down. We can go curling and tricep. You've seen me use this setup multiple ways over the last few years. The point is, it's a horizontal vector. It's going to be joint friendly. It's not going to create compression, which is ultimately what gravity does. And it's going to go ahead and allow our joints to feel something different. Therefore, the forces being applied to those joints is going to be different. And that means that our joints are not getting that same compression over and over and over every day and at every workout. And that's why I think over time, hey, your body's going to say no to weights. No problem. You got bands. And you can go ahead and work muscle strength very well with that, especially using that horizontal vector.